Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Also follow Patreon. Click on the link below in the description. It's free. But let's talk about Gilbert Arenas and Halle. So Halle Berry, who was voted the most beautiful woman in the world, I believe a couple of times, and who was a star in the 90s, early 2000s. Um, I'm in my 30s, late 30s. So any boy growing up wanted to be Halle Berry. And shout out to Ross. I've seen he made a video about it. Well, former NBA All-Star Gilbert Arenas has some interesting things to say about Halle Berry. Now, Gilbert Arenas says he was sitting around Harvey Weinstein, the uh, disgraced Hollywood executive who's currently in prison or going to be in prison for the rest of his natural life. And this is what Gilbert Arenas had to say. He said, okay, she was sitting near four, five white dudes. Harvey Weinstein was one of them. He claimed he was sitting close enough to hear the man's conversation. And he heard someone say, oh, now she acting like she don't know us. She wasn't saying that when she needed that part. And Arenas was like, Arenas said, I was like, no, not Holly. No, not none of them. Yuck. And I'll post a link to the article by the Atlanta Black Star. Well, this doesn't surprise me because in Hollywood or Hollyweird, that's what happens. Now, Harvey Weinstein was a big power, power was one of the most powerful people in Hollywood. And I think that's something we don't, a lot of times we we don't want to see and even think about like corporate America, right? You see these a lot of times beautiful young women and it'd be these older heads with they have the power to make you a star. They got a power to give you a promotion to your job. You know, you want to become a vice president, do run the company or whatever, or he can make a phone call. And a lot of times people going to do what they got to do. This is why a lot of times you see people, they just came out of nowhere. And this has been like this. Go back to the 19, uh, the 1920s when Joe Kennedy was running Hollywood. And he had all the top people in the 20s and he was married. Birth and Jack Kennedy and, and all, the, all the other kids that... Well, really his lineage is still <laughs> around in Massachusetts and New York. But you have people like Joe Kennedy that was running Hollywood. Stuff like this has and it's going to keep going like that, honestly. Even if you take away movies. We could even go back to the ancient days, right? Let's go back to the Romans when certain people was in plays and stuff like that. How do you think they was getting to the top? Yes, hard work does pay off. There are people who have worked their way up to the top. But sometimes you're going to have to make it do what it do. You know, and I don't approve of that at all. I think everybody should get there off of their hard work and dedication. But, you know, Halle Berry, you walk around, you know, and again, this is this is true because Gilbert said he heard it. But let's just not even say Halle Berry. Let's take away. Right. Let's say you got this executive who's a billionaire and he could snap his fingers and you'll be the number one person. In movies, you think most people are not going to do what they got to do? Go back and look look at look at Swole Terry Crews, right? And Terry Crews came out and literally said dude came up and grabbed grabbed his genitals in front of his wife. Yeah, Terry Crews is a big swole guy, but it's that power that that executive had that made him feel like he can do that. I mean, you see it on time after time after time. I remember back in the day when I was a teenager working at this company, this warehouse company, and like there was this woman she had absolutely no experience but she was like one of the head people running around driving beating potential dealers i'll say that and nobody can understand how did she get this position and there was always just rumors about her all the top people was flirting with her because she was a you know attractive woman for a lot of people 
So, I mean, if this is true, and again, we know how Gilbert is, but let's just say all this was true. Would you be surprised? You know, didn't Harvey Weinstein go to jail on that audio and didn't Angel he pissed off Angela Jolie back in the day and Brad Pitt had a problem with it. So, you, I mean, you see stuff like this over and over and over again where you got people that's in positions of power. So I just want to give my two thoughts on it. Tell me what y'all think in the comment section. <laughs>